everyone in my poker night is going to hear about you. Dad, what are you, what are you, what are you even doing here, Dad? I hope you don't mind, but I figured the lodge was just a nat stop away. I just had to see it. Oh, this place is everything I imagined. Do you know I dreamt of joining Constellation when I was a girl? You guys haven't been back to the apartment since I've been here. Why am I paying for this apartment? Hey, I'm not that old, dearest. But I'll let your father talk before he bursts. I was playing poker with the Dean of Engineering, and he had this collectible revolver framed. And when he heard you were in Constellation, well, we worked together to get the piece clean and restored. She fires beautifully Whoa! now. We, uh, uh, took turns sighting it at the range. I swear, your father was acting like a school kid. <clears throat> As I was a saying, gun? may I present to you Sir Malcolm Livingston's personal sidearm. All the special modifications just as he left him. He was chair of Consolation about uh, 50 years ago. Anyway, it's yours. Wow. Thanks. Next person I shoot, I'll think of you. Oh, that's a terrible joke. You are joke. joking, right? Of course you are. Well, we'll let you get back to it, <laughs> but uh, <laughs> Miss Noel said we could look around a little first. Get out of my house. Oh my God, that's an old school gun. <laughs> All right, what's next? I still don't have any money to fucking get through <clears throat> the Crimson Fleet one. I want to do the Crimson Fleet one, God damn it! Who's all on my crew now? Oh my God, a lot of people. Can I not I bring this thing service, anymore? Captain, Captain, now that you are a member of Constellation, I am at your service. I guess no you have to talk to it first. Necessary. Also, given the likelihood that you will be out in unsettled space, it might be beneficial to go over exploration outpost development in case you ever need to build a base for field no research. No shot. I just had to talk to him to fucking learn about how to build an outpost. He just, he's been standing there for the past like 20 hours. Captain, I will proceed to my assigned post. The exploration of an unknown planet can be a major undertaking. By building an outpost, you will be able to construct scanning equipment, resource extractors, He's pretty good at shield systems, though. I mean, I wonder if that would help. Even possible to Does that help buff up me up if I, if I use him on my ship? Capable of manufacturing, allowing you to build advanced equipment. Mmm. -hmm. The scan booster is the most obvious, as it will enable you to detect landmarks and other points of interest from further away. Beyond that, extractors will allow you to collect raw materials of various types, while fabricators enable the manufacturing. A particularly prosperous outpost may even warrant the construction of cargo links allowing you to share resources between other outposts you have built. Mm hmm. I mean, do you really need like something that detects the points of interest when there's only like a handful of them <laughs> on any given planet? Travel safely. I kind of want to assign him to the ship though. Let's see if that helps with my shield. I don't know if that'll actually do anything or not, but who's still, who's assigned? Get this fucker off the ship. Fuck off. There. God, I really want to fucking just get through this fucking... I just really want to get through this goddamn Crimson Fleet fucking thing, man. I've, look at all this. I did so much for it. I kind of want to try it again. I don't think it's going to work. I'm probably just going to end up dying again. <laughs> but I kind of want to try it again. I'm just going to... I'm going to do a manual save. Damn Rooks just don't know how to take a hit. Hey, Rook, want to help me with some target practice? Nope. Not again. Oh my god, his shields are going back up like instantly, man. Am I the only one alive? I'm dead. Never mind. Alright, I can do the magic man. Go to this one, I guess, first. I leveled up. Large ship in orbit, and we value discretion in this 
matter. If you are willing and able, please see me as soon as possible at the main security office in Paradiso. What is this unidentified ship? I'm about to dock on this. I'm about to dock on this ship. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what ship this is, but. It's a level 30, it says. I'm about to fucking... I'm getting in there. We've got... I'm sure whoever's in that ship will be thrilled to see you. <laughs> I'm coming aboard. Captain, it is... Pleasant to see you. You. Yeah. Good to see you too, man. Weapons at the... Remain calm. You're... Human. What the fuck is this? What are you? Oh, we're human. From the planet Earth in the Sol system. Earth? You're from Earth. I've been there. It looks like shit. Oh, pardon my ignorance. We just didn't expect to find people out here. We didn't think anyone else left Earth before us. Perhaps we should greet our guests. Of course. Manners. I'm Captain Diana Brackenridge. This is Security Officer Bomani Reader. Hmm. Ew. And this is Dr. Mabuti Ew. De Costa, one of our elders. A pleasure to meet you. <laughs> I'm too, and I'm here to help. <laughs> I see. As you may have presumed, we're in a bit of a bind. Our ship has finally completed its near 200 year journey from Earth, only to find our new home seemingly colonized by, well, we don't know. Communications haven't been successful, so your arrival is fortuitous. Perhaps you'd be willing to act as a middle person between ourselves and the others. The others? The others? How did you survive for 200 years? Well, the short answer is, we didn't. It's a generation ship, which is to say that most of us lived long, happy lives on board and passed our mission down to our children. It was never intended that the original crew would make it to our destination. The goal was always the preservation of the human race above all else. Though it would seem that was perhaps a bit <laughs> presumptuous. Give me the ship. I'll take the ship. I know, I know. But please hear me out. You came to us and so far we don't have any other options. Perhaps if you knew little more about us, it would change your mind. Now then, Please follow me. There's much to discuss first. Money. We'll speak more on the matter once we reach the bridge. Dr. Mm -hmm. DeCosta, you may return to your quarters if you wish. Give me some money. I will follow you to the bridge. We've got strict rules around here, but they're strict for a reason. I do not believe we have need to fear our guest, but I'll allow it if you insist. Now that we know what's out there, Welcome things the are going to be more interesting for Carl now. In the early 2100s, my ancestor, Rupert Brackenridge, researched a number of scientific scenarios. Climate change, Rupert? asteroid impact, nuclear war, global pandemic, and more. Each scenario showed the likelihood of an extinction-level event to be within 50 years. He the fully believed Earth was destined to be rendered uninhabitable. We've always assumed that's what happened. So, yeah, have you been there? I mean, I've been there. <laughs> build the it's ...and set a course for this planet here. We were told that it was the largest, most trouble. advanced ship ever constructed on Earth at the time. If you can believe, entire generations have been born, lived, and died on this ship. It really goes to show that there are no limits to human ingenuity and perseverance. Mm. <laughs> Never seen a ship like yours before. A key. Fuck. So, Who's got the key to this? Careful Holy waving shit. that fancy gun around. We don't need to see what it can do. We didn't believe anyone would be out here, but I'm glad for it. I think I'm coming up on six years now. I was only a teenager when my father died, passing command of the ship I to me, become the as captain, is tradition. And then I get the ship. Because of that, I've had to sort of 
learn as I go along instead of taking years of study and apprenticeship under the prior captain. I think some people on the ship resent me for not having the level of experience as my predecessors. But at the same time, without my command, we likely wouldn't have made it here so quickly. Well, as I mentioned, we've been unsuccessful in communications with anyone up until you arrived, though not for lack of trying. But since you're asking, maybe you'd be willing to be a sort of diplomat between us and them as we attempt to resolve our situation. That's Does that's, that sound that's, agreeable that's to you? That's my background. That's, that's my background. <laughs> that's crazy. What's in it for me? I wish I could say that the satisfaction of helping others in need is sufficient, but I'm not getting that impression from you. No. <laughs> I'm sure we can pull together some resources equivalent to whatever currency you use these days. We'll the do ship. what we can to make it worthwhile. And until then, you're free to make use of whatever facilities you need on our ship. All right. Uh, after, all right. Uh, all right. We know there's a settlement on the planet below, meaning people were here before us. You see, we intended to settle here, but we assume that they intend to defend their claim, given their presence here. We'd like you to go speak to them on our behalf and help us negotiate a solution, preferably one you that favors us. You can't just waltz into their, into their turf, man. They, they got here first. Yeah, how could they just settle here if you had a claim? When we left <laughs> Earth, there were no claims to planets this far out into space. We had assumed that we were the only ones attempting a generational journey such as this, meaning that there would be no need for a formal claims process. Regardless, my ancestor, Rupert Brackenridge, did manage to file a charter for this planet's first colony to be named New Jamestown. According to his records, no one took it seriously when he filed it, so likely it was either ignored or the records were lost to the ages. Given humanity's lack of interest in colonizing the far reaches of space at the time, it shouldn't have been a problem. But again, here we are now. Damn, that's crazy. My parents just took money. You're gonna have to you're gonna have to compensate for that. <laughs> yes, yes, of course. But we need to start from a firm position and state our goal. If need be, we can compromise work out a mutually beneficial deal or some such but initially i'd like you to be wait a minute with my parents and that was the first time they the took money to let me know how they respond and we'll go from there thank you and godspeed there's nothing to actually like use here on this fucking know what's out there. shit Things kind of garbage where's your guys's armory you guys have an an, an armory perhaps engineering Reactor computer? What the fuck? What is that? Hmm. I can't tell you. Oh, under supervision of a qualified engineer. How many times I got to make do? Can I fucking just blow this ship up? To complex technical problems. It fucking worked! Oh my god, what the- Oh no! Oh my god, what the fuck? No- Oh my god, no fucking- I can fucking- Oh- Oh- I kind of want to see where this goes. I might want to manual save this. I'm about to fucking blow it up. Is that... No. Nice to know there are other people out there. What the fuck? What is it? What's it going to do if I... What did it... Uh. So what was... Oh, I need to... I need to confirm it first. What is it? What did that say? I need to like confirm the override. <laughs> Bro, what the fuck? I don't understand. I didn't even go down and talk to the fucking other guy though. I kind of... Let me talk to the other guy though and see if that's... That might be something he wants us to do. He might fucking be like, nah, fuck these guys. Fucking kill them instead. And I'll... <laughs> Maybe I'll get paid for it. I can fuck 
fucking just blow them out. <laughs> we got strict rules around here. That's amazing. This might be amazing. It has potential to be amazing, but will it actually be amazing? We'll see. <laughs> Yeah, they fucking spent hundreds of years in space with the objective of landing here and settling into a new planet only for me to just blow up their entire fucking civilization on their ship. <laughs> oh my god. What the fuck? This place is nuts. Um. Uh, we try to stay out of the guest way, but we are always here. Why'd you, why you say it like that? <laughs> way. <laughs> Where's the uh, fucking. Where, where the fuck do you go to, like, get through here? Hey, what's up, man? Oh, this is the guy. Welcome to Paradiso. Jiro Sukiyama at your service. Do you have a security concern or is there something else I can help you with? <laughs> There's an entire civilization flying right above us and they want to come down here. <laughs> I will kill them something for you, you if you want. I will blow, I will blow them up. Oh, oh, your distress call. Oh, yes. Let's get right to it then. As you can imagine, we've got a predicament on our hands. Under normal circumstances, we would not enlist outside help in this matter. Was this the stress call also but in regards to that? this is a matter we can't afford to worry our guests about. As such, we need to handle this discreetly. Failure on your part to do Already so got a could plan have for severe it. consequences. So, before we proceed, can you swear not to discuss this with anyone else unless explicitly directed to do so? That's a lie, but yet... Yes, I swear. Great. I appreciate it. <laughs> Not too long ago, a strange and enormous ship appeared in Parima space. It is now locked in orbit around our planet. So far, it doesn't seem to be hostile. Oh but any attempts God. to communicate with it have been in vain, so we're unsure of the ship's intentions. Bad. Bad. They're they're coming to take over. They're coming to take over. <laughs> Oh my god, a bunch of jokers who think they own this place. Oh, I'm gonna fucking, I'm gonna shit stir. <laughs> That's a new one. Oh, you're being serious. Wow, okay. Um, you're gonna need to speak with Oliver Campbell. He's the CEO of the Paradiso Group and will know how to handle this. I'll let him know you're coming to see him. Oh shit. <laughs> Oh my god, they're gonna get blown up! <laughs> they're gonna get blown up! Oh no! Oh shit. <laughs> uh, which way do I fucking go? Do I go in there? Where the fuck do I go? I'm here to help if you need it. Don't worry about us. We're just here to keep the peace. Oh, oh my god! We have to be a down there, but this place is almost too perfect, right? A cafe. If only I could figure out the secret to that new drink. I might need to enlist outside help. Drink. I'm not really good at that kind of- Whoa! What the there fuck? There are so many activities I'm looking forward to doing, but I'm just having a good time relaxing. I can see that. Let's see. Let's see how we can make this deal better for us before we pull. Have a great off. day. <laughs> Excuse me. You can't just waltz in there. Do you have an appointment? Yes. 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 Oh, you're the one they're waiting for then. Do you need anything else from me before you meet with the board? Hmm. Whatever. Sure. Have fun in the Shark Tank, and don't worry. Even they Wait. call it that. Shark Tank? Huh? Shark Tank? <laughs> I just feel that we should be focusing on the natural beauty of this planet, 
not our amenities. We just sit down here. There are millions of planets out there. Uh, People can go to any one of them. The resort facilities are precisely what we bring to the table. Heck, <laughs> it's the only thing we've really got to offer. I can't. Uh, I don't want to risk us coming off as just another him. artificial, shady, trash fiddle dump like Neon. That's not who we are. Hey, we've hey, got something special here. I have an allegiance to here. Neon. What the fuck? We should embrace that. Belongs right. Thank you. I. We don't want to compete with Neon. Bayou's ruthless. He'll do anything he can to eliminate the competition. We don't need that kind of trouble. That being said, I think there's a middle ground. Maybe build up the beachfront in a boardwalk amusement park. I've had this idea to build artificial hot springs. That sort of thing. Uh. Sounds good. I'll look into what that will cost us and we can circle back around to this. Hey. <clears throat> I, uh, well, okay. I can't, I guess I can't talk to him. What's in not to love about this planet? I was just trying to, like, get into the RP, but <clears throat> I'll, I'll, I'll go Come around. Come on, mate. We'll make some time for you, but keep it quick, yeah? I am. And you must be the diplomat Jiro told me about. Welcome, welcome. Normally, I'd offer you an all-inclusive stay at our resort before we spoke. But given these circumstances, I'm going to cut to the chase. We've got our friends, the aliens, up there causing all sorts of problems for our resort. <laughs> aliens? You like that? The marketing team came up with it. The thought is, if we can't get rid of them, it might actually attract more tourism. Come see the aliens! <laughs> uh, <clears throat> okay. Yeah, let's just, let's just get to the matter of hand. Ah, we're being direct then. Good on you. So, what do you know about this dodgy ship I'm hearing all about? They are here to take over. They think they own your planet. Uh... <laughs> it was really an alien mothership here to destroy the planet. I'd say you're full of it and might have been watching too many movies. Now, instead of wasting my time, ah, want to tell me what it really so. is? <laughs> they go into a panic. <laughs> but so, I imagine some sort of old pre-collapse colony ship thinking they've got a claim here. Well, they don't. And that ship's presence is bad for business. We need it to bugger off ASAP. Now, tell me, what are we going to do about it? Give me some proposals, people. I need something to work with here. Hmm. We could offer to resettle them here. There's more than enough space. They could stay here. Temporarily. But it'll cost them. Quite a bit, too. They'd need to work off all their debts before being allowed to leave. Oh my god! Uh, maybe not. What we can if just we blow help them, up, them get out of here? We can just blow them up. Outfit their ship with a grab drive so they can find a new home. We could even lend our engineers to help and give their captain an updated star map. What do you think? Sounds costly. We can't absorb that cost, and it's unlikely they even have compatible currency, let alone enough for the transaction. Someone else would have to foot the bill. Oh, I swear this would be a lot easier if they ceased to exist entirely. Anyway, seems oh. got the right idea. Oh. Either works for me. Oh. Just tell me what you want to do. Oh. Oh! 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 <laughs> oh! <laughs> I'm not suggesting anything other than it would make our lives so much easier if that ship ceased existing. Make of that what you will. Ooh. Well, I think I'm gonna blow him up. <laughs> <laughs> And which proposal will you be taking to the good captain? I assume there's a captain. <laughs> uh, what if I could make a ship like that go away? I have no idea, because I'm not suggesting anything of the sort. But it's a wonder that old ship made it all the way here in such a relatively short time. Must have really been pushing themselves. An engineer friend of mine told me once that the reactors on those old ships have a tendency to self-destruct if they overload. 
Of course, their engineers must have taken great care not to push it too far. I did find Someone that out on my own. have to override the safety systems in the reactor computer. But who would do such a thing? <laughs> it, already, it already checked it off for me. That's crazy. Look at this, this smug motherfucker, man. Oh my God. Yeah, I think I'm gonna just, I think they're gone. I think they're gone. Well, I'll get rid of this and then I should probably get something, you know, pretty hefty down here, I think, for my trouble. Every day is nice around here. Oh. But I think you call us at one of the nicest. He says as he scrubs the floor. This could be the equivalent of the nuke, man. I don't, <laughs> this could be fucking crazy. I gotta one see this through. Days. I mean, I need to see if there's anything on here that I can loot first as well. I mean, they might have some valuables in here. I also need to get a key in order to do the uh, fucking computer. I guess I need to like accept it. Um, Never seen a ship like yours before. And then again, I haven't seen any ships before. To... <sighs> I need that key. God damn it, she's just gonna stand just here too. Told, doesn't mean come back, work. come back in here. <laughs> oh wait, maybe it's in the captain's room. Hiding something in here. See, like, why can't I use the hockey stick as a fucking weapon, man? This shit's got good value too. Ooh, plus 5% persuasion chance when I'm wearing this? I'm the captain now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the captain of this place now. Hey, 5%. Maybe that'll actually help me. Oh, shit. What the fuck? Now that you're here, I can finally give my crew a chance at a new life. Yo, ain't no way. <laughs> it fucking worked! What the fuck? What the fuck? Oh my god. Full waving that fancy gun around. Oh, it's this one here. Oh, I still have to unlock it. No! God damn it, she has a digi pick on her too. Hold on. <laughs> oh no, I gotta cheese it again. Oh my goodness. We were never trained to address threats coming from outside our ship. <laughs> Holy shit, what the fuck? It's like this game wanted me to fucking just kill them all. These don't fit in. Okay, so those are those are the two duds then. Oh, it actually makes these a little easier now. Uh these other ones then. Steaming. Um, maybe these. <clears throat> and then for the middle one, it'd be these. Yeah. I'm the captain. <clears throat> she got messages. Turns out there was a slight misalignment in engine base six causing all the rumbling. Oh no, we've arrived at New Jamestown. They don't have any landing gear. They also think it's alien life. <laughs> I'm, I'm like, li listen, I'm looking to see if there's anything in here. There's gotta be something that makes it so that way these people are, are worse than what it's, you know. Right now they seem like pretty good people. They're out of strawberries for God's sakes. Oh no. Oh, 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 God. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Oh, 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 God. Oh, God. I knew letting outside visitors. Ah! Oh, fuck. Ah! I couldn't do it without fucking. Ah! I can't. Is there not a way to do it in secret? <laughs> I wanted to fucking do it in secret and then dip. I mean, it sounds, it sounds an alarm, so I don't think I'm going to be able to do it. Also, I got to fucking do this. God damn it. I got to do this again. 
Here, I'll do this first and then I'll fucking quick save it so I don't have to do this shit again. Like, there's no way I'm gonna be able to do this and then fucking. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck. I'm gonna have a fucking book. Drop your weapons and face it. I'm sorry. Uh. Oh, fuck. I went on the wrong side. Oh, run. Oh, God. Chill. made it i fucking made it i fucking made it i'm quick saving i fucking made it oh god here i can shoot up this stuff here i know what i did was wrong okay uh, uh. robot help robot get me the fuck out of here i'm fucking out of here i fucking made it go 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 get the fuck out of here we gotta fucking get off of this place it's gonna fucking blow up go <laughs> oh no! That's crazy. Hello. Oh my god. Oh my god, the people of Earth are dead. Oh my god. That was all the people all the people of Earth are dead. They're fucked up. They're gone. Now I'm gonna go collect my reward. Oh my god. 200 years of their civilization trying to reach this moment. Only the fucking blow up. That's crazy. <clears throat> What's this guy gonna say now? Whoa! Did you see those bloody fireworks way up in this guy? The what? tourists think we set him off, but I don't know where they came from. That's crazy. That was that was him blowing up. Oh, amazing. I mean, that is quite an unfortunate tragedy. It's best not to dwell on it, though. On the bright side. Our issue seems to be solved. Yeah, like, where's the... Oh, I want double whatever you're offering or I'll go to the authorities. And tell them what? That you blew up an entire colony ship and killed hundreds of people? No. Even if they listen to you, <laughs> how do you think that will play out for you? Tell you what. You threaten me, now you get nothing. And... There's not a thing you can do about it. Good eye. Damn! I got fucked! It's because of me. Hello? I didn't realize Kiwi was letting people in here. Good <laughs> shit. Sorry, you've got to go. <laughs> yeah, I don't know if I can kill this guy now, but I'm kind of tempted to, you piece of shit. You fucking... <laughs> Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. Well. Damn it. Damn, that was a crazy mission, man. What the fuck? That was crazy. I don't even care that I didn't get anything. I'll just Hi there. I've I'll got a lot rob, of I'll right just now, rob this I'm guy. Happy to help you <clears throat> What do you have? Come on, mate. Loads more interesting things to do outside. I need to mill about in here. He doesn't even have anything. What's not to love about this planet? This is a boardroom, not a singles mixer, or whatever you're looking for. <laughs> the deal never closed. At the very end, the deal never closed. After <laughs> doing all that. <laughs> Holy shit. It does suck that I can't fucking kill those guys, but whatever. Uh, is this the place? What is that? Wait, wait, wait. What's that? Hey, 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 hey. Don't mind us. Just passing through. Need something? I 
can fucking pirate these guys? Let's trade. I can probably help you out. Oh wait, what? Why do we trade like this? I wanna like no no no, I wanna I wanna I wanna come aboard. I want everything in your cargo right now. You out of your mind or something? Uh <clears throat> hand it over or else. <laughs> Tell me why I shouldn't fight you right now. Because I don't like this co oh, hey, 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 wait, 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 come, hold on, why are you leaving? I'm about to fucking do the persuasion thing. What the fuck? Where are you going? I'll turn your ship into a pile of wreck. Hey, you're leaving the conversation. We're talking. There's no need for that kind of talk. Yeah, get back here. I hit you with another four, and this is, this is going to be it. No one needs to know what you gave up in your cargo. I suppose I could make up some sort of an excuse. Oh, oh. It puts me in the hole, but it's cheaper than fixing up my ship after combat. That's right. Just take the cargo and leave us in peace. That's it? That's all she had? I'll take these credits. The fucking 1,200 credits. I don't care about any of this other stuff. That's all you fucking had. I did that speech check just for that. And they're fucking gone already. That was trash. him down maybe or like is that 30 percent chance for persuasion now honestly i kind of oh god it's such a waste to fucking keep putting shit in there but persuasion stuff has been pretty good so far <clears throat> they're upset with me Oh, he was level eight. I probably could have maybe did it. Oh, his ass. Damn, the robot's getting in there. a pussy like actually fucking ran away Grenades. i'm gonna have to switch weapons again what in the world is this Die! Holy shit! 
What the fuck are you on? I don't even remember what I like why I got put on this quest in the first place other than chat telling me to go to this quest. I mean, was it what was it? Oh. It's just a mystery. There's just a mystery here. Superhero? Is the mantis a superhero? You picked the wrong fight. Oh. Ah. ah! Fuck! Ah! Fuck! Ah! Fuck! I can't run. Oh my God. I have no more health either. I am so fucked. Why did that sound like that was like behind me? The gold mine. Oh, there's a new melee weapon. How much is this? This is the one. Oh my god, it's only 25. That's garbage. Melee is trash in this game, it seems. They go. God. Thirty again? A level eight and a level thirty. I'm so confused by it. And then, oh my god! And I just dropped that fucking level thirty like nothing. I guess. got spacer communication number two how many of these fucking things did they send out the same note an expert safe surely there's got to be something in there right companion affinity increases faster for 10 minutes oh my god oh persuasion chance for 10 minutes as well no i need a digi pick god damn it I use these so much. Uh, is there any in here? It's 
sleep on this cot so I can heal and get my buff back. No, there was a bunch of explosions, like, or explosives in the fucking back there. I don't even know where the other body went. Oh, there it is. Oh, yeah! Digipick! Let's go! Here we go, an expert. I'm fucking ready. I'm fucking ready. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, I got it. I got it. I got it. I was, I was dumb. I got it. that damn let's go. i got a lot of ammo for this fucking thing but i don't know if this is worth it it has like a crimson fleet like fucking skin on it <clears throat> it's like a little oozy where the fuck the robot is man the robot has just completely fucked off i got one down i got one down i gotta save so that way so i can just get the other ones oh fuck No ammo. I'm gonna have to keep going down to like fucking shit. Done. Three more down there. I need to buy like a shit ton of fucking heals or something, man. What in the world? I'll go this way instead. Maybe does somebody have help in anywhere here. A corrosive rescue. find a cot if I can find a little cot up 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 wait that's oh I was gonna say that's genius 
I'll go find a fucking cot and just lay down. That's what I'm gonna go do. That's right. <laughs> Easy foil. Holy shit. I don't think this, this gun, this gun is just not it. This gun is, I don't know what the fuck is going on here. But I have no ammo and like anything else. So. Get three shots in that, and then I'll fucking <laughs> switch to something else. God, that's like that might be the only thing I fucking have. I got some ammo for this, I guess. There's still music. There's one expert. Master! Oh my god. Oh my god, a med pack. And there was more cots here so I could sleep again. Yeah, I got a skill point. I don't want to use it though until I've been using them, but I I don't want I wanna wait until like there's a point where I like might need it. Funny that I don't even have the stealth perk and yet I'm using the pickpocketing thing. Do level two on the shotgun thing. I'm just gonna fucking wait until I actually need something. What else is down here? I have no ammo, please. I have nothing. What was that? Whoa! What the fuck is that thing? None of these do anything. Like, they don't do better damage. I have to just keep switching back and forth because I don't have fucking any ammo. Holy shit, man. How many motherfuckers are in this place? I'm gonna use this. I'm gonna use this fucking arc. Welder thing on the bob. I'm gonna see you. <laughs> Maybe this will do something. I don't even know. Oh, shit. That's a little tease, actually. Get up. Oh. Holy shit. He's a fucking 38. What the fuck? Why? Why is he a level 38? This is absurd. <laughs> My, eyes! My eyes! Oh my god! 
That's true. There is a cop behind me. I wonder if it'll count that I'm in. Fuck it. We're just gonna have to abuse this cop. <laughs> Kill one and then run back to the cot. Sleep again. Take a little nap. This level 38 is impossible. There's no way I'm going to be able to fucking kill this guy. You guys got uh, another gun, maybe? Is there another gun? Nobody had another gun, right? Fuck it. I guess I'll fucking use this. I'm using every fucking gun that I pick up now at this point. This is a weird looking shotgun. Are these guys? Oh, there's a guy right here. I was like, what? All fucking headshots, man. I don't know what the hell is going on. You <laughs> get some fucking crazy ass high levels. Should be like two more left. Get up, you bitch. Come on, just hit him once. Now I gotta get that fucking high level guy out of here. <laughs> back, back to the cot again. Oh my god. What the fuck do you do here? There's no way this guy's normally level fucking 38. Like, what? Got a shrapnel day. Nothing. <laughs> oh my god. when enemies get like this man it's like they have they it purposefully puts them at a sliver so you have to like get their you have to like put their shield down one more time before they fucking die he's got nothing left and he still won't die what the fuck is that fucking big And then he runs away. What? I mean, no fucking way. You are, he's actually running away after all that. Jesus Christ, man. He had, he had some money. Oh, some flannel. This pistol actually is probably better than the one that I have, I think. Maybe. Also can't get in that lock either. Hello, I finally fucking did it after 10 wait, years. Wait, don't shoot, I am unarmed. Look, we can help each other. I can be useful. Just don't kill me. Livy. And I mean you, uh, no harm. This place was full of traps. Traps everywhere. I removed them. But this, this corridor is just too dangerous. See? Looks normal. One step inside, slam! You are trapped. And nobody's been standing after the doors reopen. Hmm. 
No one knew how to get through the corridor. But I figured it out. There are letters on the floor. It is a grid. Those letters must spell something. But there are so many words or small phrases. You do it. <laughs> what? Well, nobody else here figured that out. See? I've been helpful. You... you could let me go. Or better, I can help. I know these traps. I know how this mantis thinks. Please, let me help. And just give me a taste of the cachet inside. You can trust me. All right. Spoken like a true spacer. You won't regret this. He I opens it and then here. I kill him. And, well, good luck. <laughs> oh, shit. Uh, oh. Oh. Okay, well, is he gonna come fucking do this or, or what? <laughs> Damn, if I fucking was able to use a computer, I probably wouldn't need to fucking do any of this, but I don't think I can I don't think I have the ability to use the uh I just I just unlocked this other one. Yeah, fuck. This guy's supposed to be fucking over here helping. What are you doing? This is killed so many of us. Okay, so what's stopping me from just like jumping over this? What is that? M? Is that M or three? I just go over it. Ah! What? Ah! 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 Ooh! Ah! I, I didn't even touch anything! I didn't even... I didn't even touch it! What letter is that? What? It, it's supposed to spell something out is what he said? What the fuck is the point of this guy if he's not even gonna fucking... Shoot these things? 46? 46. It was like final recorder. Yeah. Turrets. Turrets. Oh, it is by this one. Mom, why the hell? This whole thing is a sick joke. You gotta get out. Oh, God. What? That was it? Almost touching. But then the punchline. Hmm. No one here. Last letters. Start with AM. Keep your eyes on him. Didn't start with AM. And she ends not with an I love you or an I'm proud of you. No. Mm. Six Semper Tyrannus. Oh. Did I touch it? Did it? Was it not? Was it not T? It is T, but something fucked up here. I... <laughs> Iranus. How do I spell Tyrannus? <laughs> I don't remember how to spell this. Is it I? I S? I S? No! I'm here already. I'm here already. No! It was one more. It was. It was another N, and then I. <laughs> I I don't did it. I don't did it. I don't did it. I don't did it. It's amazing. Now, no, no, must no, no, be no, careful. Here. There will be traps, robots, the turrets. Very dangerous. I feel like I'm going to get betrayed here. <laughs> oh my God! Is the expert one too? Alright. 
correct. Lock it in. Easy. Fucking easy. Fucking easy. Fucking easy. What is that? A pair? a better arc welder instead i can just drop this one he should definitely be yielding like higher results <laughs> good luck buddy that's an expert door oh my loot ah! Ah! he fucking warned me go in get hit by any of that he just fucking like ran through he didn't, he didn't even get didn't even shoot at him I sure hope there's a bed over here look at that it doesn't even <laughs> Holy shit, man. Now I'm gonna have to do the same thing to the robot. Unless... Do you think they get affected by this? Probably not. Alert. Hostiles may be nearby. Oh. Oh my god, there's more. There's more. There's more. There's more than one. He's just gonna stand there in the middle of the way and body block and not even fight. Bro, what the fuck is this? I'm out of health again. What the fuck? Motherfuckers behind me. Bro, how? Where's my robot, man? He's been MIA for the whole fucking thing. Oh, one's down, one's down, one's down, one's down. Oh my God. Kind of crazy. Everything is like way over my level. Am I not supposed to be here yet? I can only loot one of them. I can't, I can't even loot the other one. I am sorry I could never show this lair to you. The lair is a secret that's been passed down for over a hundred years. And there are rules. You remember when you were a teenager? All the training. The drills, 
All of it was to prepare you for this. I know you have it in you, Leon. Oh no, what the fuck does that mean? Is a robot dog. What? <laughs> what? What? What the fuck? How the fuck am I gonna kill that thing now? I I literally have nothing. And this thing's just gonna fucking bulldoze right through the door. What if I sneak? <laughs> Thank you! Now the treasure of the mantis will be mine! <laughs> it will be Did he just blow up? <laughs> did he just blow up out there? What the fuck did he even try to do? I don't understand what he... What was it? Oh, shit. I don't understand what his betrayal even was. Oh, there it is. It's an, oh, oh, what the... Oh, what the fuck? Yeah, the door, the door, the door doesn't, the door doesn't exist. The door doesn't matter. The door doesn't exist and the door doesn't matter. I don't even know how that guy, how, well, how did he even die? I don't even know what the fuck happened. God damn it, man. What the fuck that did, but okay. open door. Oh, my God, this is a fucking shortcut. That's all this is, is a fucking shortcut. I can't fucking make it out there. No! Oh my god, I get. Oh, what the fuck? Bro, there's shit everywhere in here! Actually, grab this shit though. I fucking there's fucking robots all over this fucking floor. Hey, 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 Jill, Jill, we're cool now. I want that spacesuit too. I want that. I'm so afraid to fucking like maneuver around this fucking spot, man, because there's just fucking this little dickhead everywhere. You need to leave this area immediately. Yep. Yep, yep, I'm leaving. I don't think there is anything. Oh you my god. Are not allowed in this area. Leave the area. This area is off. <laughs> you 
<laughs> it's your last warning. Ew. Got a bunch of food over here. Oh, here we go. Please, let me turn them off. Scorched Earth. So what happened to what happened to Leon? Did he get fucked up by the fucking turrets and that was it? And then he never was able to claim the stuff. It sounded like he was dying on his last recording. He was like, eh, "Oh, mom, no, why?" And then he died. Did exactly that. That's what I heard on the voice thing. <laughs> why did you do this to me? Wow! Look at that. Oh shit, it's legendary stuff. How is it that the legendary stuff is somehow not as good? That's crazy. Only the helmet is better than the shit that I got. I mean, this shit's worth a pretty penny though. And of course, now I weigh too much. I can't even drop anything. Damn, she had weights down here. She was fucking pumping iron. Damn, look at that. Plus 20, wait, what, on the pack? Oh, plus 20 carry capacity. Jesus, so you have to wear this shit in order to get out of here. How futuristic. I'm the mantis now, I guess. I guess that was it. Oh wait, there's more over here. Oh my God. And there's an expert thing here. What the fuck? Oh. Oh, here we go again. Oh boy, here we go. Lock it in, lock it in, lock it in, lock it in, lock it in. God damn. I'm just so fucking good at that. I'm just so fucking good at that. Exotic, inorganic resource. You would think that would be more valuable. Fuck it, I'll just take it. I don't know. Maybe it's worth a damn because it's. I don't fucking know. Do I just go back out the same way I came now to fucking get the ship? I'd imagine it's like right above me. All right. Do I have any? I don't. I still don't have any health, man. It's been forever since I fucking like. <laughs> since I've seen daylight, I've been in this fucking mission, and oh my god, I can't even get up this. <sighs> Whoa! Is this for me now? Oh my god, two thousand credits. Where did I get the money from? Into the unknown. Wait, is it over? Oh yeah, I guess it's I guess that's it. It's over. You just go near the ship and that's it. Razor beef. Oh my god, am I actually gonna be able to survive that other mission now? What happens to my old ship? <laughs> Where does the other one go? Wow, there's some big balls at the back of this one. Look at those big balls. This thing has the same amount of shield as, as my other one. <laughs> How is this gonna let me survive anymore? <laughs> there's no way. Ship. Your previous home ship has been added to your fleet. Retrieve ships in your fleet that you've left behind. Oh. Cargo has 420 instead of 450. It has a bit higher shield. I don't know if this is gonna fucking like. I hope it lets me survive. <laughs> 